this morning, we're getting our first look at the transformation of an iconic piece of Buffalo architecture. You know, we watched as crews made over part of the old Richardson Olmsted complex and turned it into the new Hotel Henry Urban Resort and Conference Center. We're for Buffalo this morning, and this morning we are taking you inside. News Force Katie Alexander giving us a sneak peek, and she is there live. Good morning. Good morning, Jordan and Brittany. We are on the second floor in that iconic Towers building right now. One of a few gathering spots that are open to the public if you want to come take a look around. This is Jessica Mancini. Uh, and of course, people are going to be here tomorrow evening for that art walk. Yes, so tomorrow evening is Hotel Henry's first art walk. Um, we're very excited to present Hotel Henry's permanent collection featuring mostly. Uh, Western New York artists in a variety of mediums. Right behind us here, we have Eileen Pleasure. Um, you're going to see a lot of um, varying colors and textures in, in her pieces. We have a couple pieces from her. Um, the artists will be here tomorrow, um, so you're welcome to come in and explore. It's a completely free event, open to the public, no tickets required. You can explore the spaces. You can see all the different art that we have on display. Um, a lot of the artists, you can, you can, they'll be here. You can meet them. They'll have. Um, pop-up space in the restaurant, 100 Acres, where they'll be selling prints. And um, we're actually working right now through a curatorial process with galleries and, and artists alike to see how we can really evolve our art program and get some um, some pop-up revolving collections through the spaces. If you, if you look through the spaces, they really do just just call for art, and a lot of people will see that tomorrow when they're when they're exploring. Well, and that's the thing with these high ceilings. These it's basically a blank canvas on the walls calling for that art. How would you describe the the style of the art that's here right now? I mean, it, it truly is a blank canvas, and you see any you see anything from from photography to abstract to abstract oil on canvas to to um, more abstract sculpture, it, it really does just like the 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 modern decor complements the the volume of space and the historic touches. Um, the curio the curatorial process really seeks out art that is going to do the same. It's it's really going to complement what you're seeing in the building already. There's there's just so much harmony that that can be made. It truly is amazing to see how it all works together. We've been looking around the Hotel Henry throughout the morning and seeing the little bits of the the bones of the building showing through, complementing the modern decor. It's a beautiful vision. What's it like for you working here? <laughs> It's absolutely incredible. I mean, every every time you come in, there's there's something new, there's something fun, there's something unexpected that you're going to find, and there's so much that, I mean, the permanent collection, people will have to see for themselves, We're, and you're welcome to come in. Of course, that permanent collection is available for you to see tomorrow during the Art Walk, 4 to 7 p.m., right here at the Hotel Henry. If you want information about that, you can go to the Founded on 4 section of our website, wivb.com. For now, reporting live, Katie Alexander, News 4. Thank you, Katie.